everybody, it's me, Miss uh, Foot Fixer. We have this lovely patient I've been seeing for years for other issues. Uh, and then she, she sent me a picture of this bad boy. And she um, asked me if, if this is a corner of Ruga. Why, why don't you guys answer that for her? Uh, it's, so it's quite painful actually. So she has a uh, Morton's neuroma. So um, on the uh, between the fourth and the fifth, and that's really, really rare because usually Morton's neuroma is on like second and third. And Morton's neuroma is just inflammation of the, of the plantar uh, uh, and nerve. And she has orthotics already. So what I'm gonna do now is just scrape this back very gently. And I'm using a 15 blade here. Let's just scrape off the first layer. So without recording this, um, well obviously we're gonna record it and remove it. How, how bad is the pain out of, out of 10 for this bad boy? And so she said that this is um, a seven out of 10. So that's quite bad for something so small. It's really like a size of a little tiny pen dot. You take off the first layer first, just to get down to the base. And, and I've taped the fifth toe down so that it's not in the way. I think I started doing that just recently actually. You know, being a podiatrist for like so long. You learn tricks and like, oh, I'm just taping it down so I can see. Why make your life so hard, right? Sometimes it's quite painful because this might be an ulcer in the knee. I'm just going to leave that. A bit of tissue here that I don't want to budge. How's your other toe feeling? We're just um, we're doing an, uh, a nail removal on the other toe, so we're just numbing this while we or numb the big toe while we remove this bad boy here. This actually, I told her that might take it's, it just takes more time to do because it's such a small area. Good thing I got good eyesight. <laughs> Trying to, you're giving me a bit of pressure. She just like, she, the first thing she, she said to me, you have amazing fingernails. I'm like, really? really? You're the last, first person to say that in my entire life. Really? Yeah, I just have normal nails. <laughs> it's like, I'm sorry, like, my chicken nails are your fingernails are same. <laughs> She's very complimentary today, like, compliment. What's the word? Mm. Just very nice today. Because <laughs> I'm removing her nails. She's like, Man, we not be mean to marry him. She's just putting a needle in my foot. She's smart. <laughs> so I'm just now I'm just flicking it out. A corn is a little bit of keratin um, caused by pressure friction that has dug deep in, into your skin. Uh, and it's called a little tiny kind of like corn shape um, kind of a piece of keratin and it digs into your skin and it hurts That's it. Just, it's just dead skin but hard piece of dead skin like a little tiny rock Vruca is a virus uh, HPV virus caused by um, either you, um, one thing is that you have a suppressed immunity, you can pick up, pick up viruses a lot more easier. But usually it's from dirty surfaces like gym floors or swimming pools or somewhere contaminated. Yep, you're feeling that. That's mm -hmm. the base. Yeah. So in in a way. In a way, you kind of want a Fuka, I guess, because Fuka can go away. So I'm taking it out. You would need to. 
you would need to um, probably use a separator. I have one anyways. Make sure that your, your footwear is wide enough. And then maybe even change your, if, if, if the thotic is the thing that has made this, let's say, then you need to maybe ask them to adjust your orthotics. So, because the orthotic is making your foot wider, right? And if you're not changing your footwear, then obviously then the toes are squeezed together. That's another thing. Just very concentrated because it's so small. Okay. And that's weird, isn't it? We're getting at the base of it. But try to not have any sudden movements because blade is uh, like it's the same with the needle right yeah. I have no control when, when patients have said the mood but you're doing really well for the lesion being really really painful what I'm gonna do is just use a drill Definitely, can you spray some chlorhexidine for me, please? Mm -hmm. But this bit that doesn't want to come out, okay. I'll take my drill from me, please, and just give me my 15 blade. Doesn't want to come out. Just a little bit. before good yeah. so you have a little tiny kind of um, hole there mm -hmm. but it's not an ulcer or anything like that but we'll, we'll put a plaster over it just to separate that area you 
him in a little bit if you can. That's the Hulk. That's a little bugger that's massive and a bit annoying. It's all clean and clear. Okay, thank you.